Hello, welcome back to Maneater. So, uh, apparently a DLC just dropped today. Um, I wasn't aware that there was a DLC coming out. Um, so, yeah, I guess uh, that's gonna <laughs> add to this playthrough of the game once we get to that point. It looks like you need to be level 40 for the DLC, so we're still... Yeah, we're still a little ways out for that at level 23, but still, um, it'll be cool to check out. Also, after the last hunter fight, we got a bone body upgrade. Well, I just want to compare these. Oh! So this gives a... the tiger body gives more... I, didn't even, I wasn't even paying attention to this. It gives more uh, materials, like minerals, proteins, fats, you know, you can see it there. Or is this one gives more armor? Uh, I think we're gonna upgrade. Oh, hold on. Let's upgrade this one while we can. Okay. We'll keep we'll keep the tiger body for now. Well, let's look at this one real quick. Wait, this has a unique ability. Oh, that's cool. Okay, well, I just wanted to see what it looked like. Wow, that is menacing. Holy. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna keep the uh, tiger body for the moment until we fully upgrade the bone body, <laughs> and then we'll go from there. Um, level thirty-five for that. Oh, requires truth quest and level thirty-five for the last one. Interesting. When do I get the tail upgrade? Okay, well, in this episode we're going to take on Ensign Tyler Dixon. Huh. <laughs> Career Coast Guard Ensign never advancing due to his unlimited laziness. <laughs> he sounds like the uh, main character for a uh, 80s or 90s sitcom. Military sitcom, I should say. Um, okay, so we're gonna go do this mission. As per usual, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna do a couple missions. We'll uh, then take on the hunter, and I imagine we'll unlock the next area, or we may have already unlocked the next area. I'm not sure. I'll have to look. need to eat more of these uh, creatures that give minerals and oils. Or, is it oil? I don't even remember what the other nutrient is. Looks like an oil drop. Oh. Oh, well. Totally failed to get that old lady. Sorry, lady. People seem so incompetent. Ooh, there's a license plate. Okay, come on. There we go. Nice. There's another one. Let's, uh, let's eat some more people before we head for the other license plate. Hey, look at this guy. What is he doing? What is he doing? <laughs> now he runs, and he only runs like 10 feet. Oh my. I thought I had that lady. Never mind. Aha, stupid hunters, I have defeated you with your own technology. A dock. <laughs> uh, these are some nice boats. Oh, 
sailing lesson. He'd sit up on his trawler, waving his hunting rifle, yelling at me to sail faster. Okay, hold on. There's a, there's a box over here. I think it's in here, isn't it? Yep. Nice. Anyone who has delved into the stomach contents of a shark is a bit more than that. Where's that other life spike? That I saw. I don't even remember where I saw it. That's our part. Am I blind? My, how am I missing? Okay. I'm not taking that. Stupid hunters. Okay, where was that license plate? First one was on that roof. And the second one was over here somewhere. Oh, I think I see a landmark over there. Yeah, I do see a landmark. Let's grab this landmark. Oh, it's this boat, isn't it? Pride in boat ownership manifests itself in a variety of ways. USS Get Fish. <laughs> ah, can I sink it? Can I not sink it? Doesn't seem like I'm able to. Okay, I think the license plate might have been up. It might be up here. Let's see if we can re alert the hunters. No, nope, I guess not. We've officially lost them. Okay, no, it's not up here because I can't get up here. Where was that license plate? Where was I looking? This one, I was looking right in this direction. Okay, back in the water. Well, that was a weird sounding sonar. Okay, hold on. Did I not see another one? Okay, I'm pretty sure I was right up here. What did I see? Oh, it was over there. Wow. I could have sworn it was over where I was looking. At the base of the buildings over there. Just blind today. Okay. Uh. Hold on. I'm gonna do this one. Where's this at? Oh, it's not too far off. Can we cross? Oh yeah, we can totally cross this one. Just so silly. Fire the seal. So oh, I thought this boat was sunk for a second. Uh. Did I not just knock someone in the water? They just threw TNT onto this boat. I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter if there's a shark on the boat with any people. Um, I don't think the owners would be very happy if somebody's throwing a TNT at it. I need 
to eat something else. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. I'm struggling to get the fish there. Hello, little seal. Goodbye, little seal. Oh, yeah. Man, these are just going to be everywhere. on this mission too. Wow. Just threw that TNT straight up at these people. I said all kind of things about Mama Maybell, but she always gave me a fair price on Phoenix. realm of just absolute cartoony nonsense with the amount of uh, dodging and flying I can do as a shark. <laughs> Man, these boats have a lot of health. Absolutely capsize that boat. Boat's gone, baby. Got a new wave of hunters. With an angry bull shark loose, local hunters are forced to post bail. <laughs> Almost there. Wow, it's taking a long time to get to Infamy Rank 5. Really gotta go to town on these guys. There he is. That took way too long. The Hoosier hotshot, Ensign oh Tyler Dixon. <laughs> Gotta be her. <laughs> he, he does not look intimidating. He looks like a joke. Okay, let's find this joke. There he is. Almost out. Oh, well, he's gone. Oh, we've got diving hunters now. Oh, man. This is just getting insane. Seriously obnoxious. Man, 
That does a lot of damage to folks. I should just be doing the evade all this time. It shreds boats. fun. Where is this goal? Not nearly as much of a challenge as I thought it would be. Today. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Traveling around, we are constantly reminded of how man's intrusion has disrupted the fragile equilibrium of the marine world. Oh yeah. Bull sharks have a habit of gobbling up anything that finds its way into the water. Yeah, I'm guessing my way out is the same way I came in. Humans' attention Unless spans this is a different way. They've already forgotten about the shark and her many crimes, so thus ends the battle. <laughs> yeah, let's munch some normal creatures for a minute. Uh, resources. Electric fins. Oh, I had to upgrade in the grotto. Okay, I wasn't sure. Oh, nice. Ugh, it's gonna be hard to choose. Oh, wow. Well, I'm going to keep what I've got because I like the, uh, the gathering resource or the resource gathering uh, abilities. Makes it so that upgrading is a little easier to do. through this place with the upgraded sonar. There's probably stuff everywhere. It's just so immense. Okay, where are we at? Um, I may have to dedicate an episode to collecting all these uh, extras. Let's go to this one. Let me go see what... Pete's been up to. He's probably building a warship or something. As twilight falls, Pete is in an uncharacteristically quiet mood. It's a dangerous job. It's not something unknown to me. Well, you want to see dangerous? Look at that, yeah? That's PT-522. My daddy crewed that off of Guadalcanal. It was Navy. Gunner's mate. Pacific Theater. But when I was 16 men, came back a day later with three. Man survives all that. Just to die here in the Gulf. What happened to him? Oh, you don't mind me saying this. A 
And my daddy, his granddaddy, was killed by a mega shark. I, I, I'm sorry. He's talking about a prehistoric fish that went extinct 2.6 million years ago. I seen it. Now, you were a kid. <laughs> Ain't they discover new animals all the time? Sort of. Well, not, not exactly. In lots of cases, they're just corrections of species with different names. Also stuff like misspelling. But I just say it. Maybe there are things in the water that ain't in your textbook. Stick around. Maybe you learn a thing or two this summer. <laughs> oh, my. Whatever. The ocean is vast. The majority of it still remains unmapped and unexplored by mankind. Perhaps Kyle shouldn't be so quick to dismiss his father's fevered ramblings. <laughs> uh, he's building a warship, or at least he's got one. <laughs> Scaly Pete is nearby. Wait, I can fight him? Don't I have to go through all these other hunters first? Shouldn't I go through all these other hunters first? Is this just optional? Oh. Okay. Interesting. Well, uh, let's go to the grotto. Have I not been to that? Hold on. Apparently there's a grate down here somewhere. We'll go to the grotto. Uh, do some upgrades after I search this cave. Uh, I've already been in this cave. No, I haven't. This is supercharged with super dark. The shark now has an asymmetric edge on the competition. I can't see a thing. Um, is this how this is supposed to be? I haven't adjusted any of my settings anywhere. Oh, wow. This is a very large cavern. The shark uses lipids from high fat fare like this to help fuel her reign of terror. Oh, it's because it's night outside, that's why. The lighting's weird at night, I guess. Um, I feel like I'm lost here. Uh, there's got to be another way out of here. There we go. Nope, that's not something. Seriously? Do I have to come out the way I came in? That seems really dumb, like they wouldn't plan it that way. There's gonna be a cave here, I'm guessing. Uh, okay, here we go. There we go. I think that's where I came in anyway. Did I just go in a big circle? Okay, where's the grotto to the left? That's it. Once more, the shark turns back to this place of centered pole. Okay, let's do some upgrading. Okay, uh... 
upgrade these? Yes, I should. Um. Well, now I can't upgrade this one. <laughs> it's just, it's always one thing or another. Uh, okay. This one does a lot less damage. It has better defense, though. Yeah, we'll do that one for now. Um, wonder what the head upgrade will be once I get that. Okay, well, I think that's it for this episode. Uh, if you like what you saw, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.